oncologists are doctors for life. And that means a lot because we stick with our patients and they stick with us. I was diagnosed in 2005 with terminal advanced metastatic breast cancer. It spread to liver, lungs, and bone. It was going to be over for me pretty quick. The ability to treat cancer is evolved. It was really very sparse. We had no drugs, oh gosh, for 10, 15 years that were new. And to think of the changes that have happened in that 50 year period, um, you know, that's remarkable. A U.S. oncology research has been involved in many, many trials. Um, I believe the latest number I've heard is 64,000 patients to clinical research studies. What this has led to are breakthroughs. Now we have 15 drugs, and you may use them in any different course during their disease. Drugs which either turn on the immune system or targeted therapies, antibody therapies. There's a lot of people living a lot longer. Every single treatment that we have today, we have because of the previous contributions of men and women who went on clinical trials. The two are just can't be separated. Patient care and research, they're very intertwined. About three or four years into different regimens, I was offered to get into a clinical trial. The CT scans were every six weeks. Of the 14 that were in the liver, after the first CT scan, there were seven. After the second CT scan, there were five, then three, then one, then zero. And it has been zero ever since. <laughs> I think clinical research provides the chance of miracles, and even when miracles aren't delivered, it generates hope. Hope is something that I, I think it would be very hard to live without hope. Hope that I can bring a therapy to a patient today that perhaps I couldn't yesterday. That's the hope I have, and that's what research really brings to the table for me in my practice. Nothing is more rewarding than when you have a patient come in and tell me, I was out with all my friends the other day and they said, you don't even look like you have cancer. One more year, one more milestone. With your husband and children and grandchildren and friends. I think that there's still more to come.